Hi there and welcome back uh, to my video about Motic. Um, in today's video, I'm going to show you uh, landing pages. Um, so basically how you can uh, start to create some with uh, the builder. There are other techniques uh, viewable on the internet, but I'm just going to show you the one with uh, the backend of, of Motic. So you just need to go over here in landing pages, click on new. And if you do so, so you can select a template, you will see uh, straight away where the problem is. And the problem is the following one is that here, when you create a landing page, Motic is expecting you to insert a form. And as far as you don't have a form already created, you won't be able uh, to end the page. So I will say that the first piece of advice is to go and to create a form. So you go over here, you create a form, you click on new, uh, you choose one of those two methods. I'm in case we say like general maybe like a general form and in this general form i'm going to add some fields uh, one of them is going to be a text field it's going to be like uh, the first uh, first name so i'm just going to go over here i'm going to just select the first name so i added it and then i'm going to add another one which is a, the family name so the text as well it's going to be like family name and we'll go over here and select the last name okay all good and of course we want probably the email so i'm just going to select here the email and call it email and the contact type is an email okay so all good so i get the three uh, that i want uh, i can call it uh, general okay all good save and close and then save and close okay great so um now I get my form and as you can see it has an ID which is the ID number four and it has a name which is general. And now if I go over here and create a landing page, I'm gonna select um, it can be this one or can be this one. This one's not bad at all. I like this one. So I'm gonna select this one. Okay, now I'm gonna use uh, the builder. And as you can see uh, on the landing page, I can of course change the, the logo. So for example, I can click over here, I can replace it and put uh, an image, for example, that I inserted in the past. Um, and I can uh, select this one. So here I, I get my logo. I can change the color of the gray area here. I can change the picture in the background. I can change the, um, oops, the CTA. So I can change it and say, hey, and buy my product so I can change everything in order to make it as my own landing page but for the part that we have an interest in which is the following one which is uh, the form ID uh, what I need is that I need to modify this and here I need to uh, put a bracket like this and as a result you see Motic is in fact suggesting us what we should pick up so in my case, I should pick up the form number four. And here I don't mind about this part anymore. Um, so here I'm all set. So in fact, I can just apply it. And so there are some form validation error. Title, title is requested. Please close the builder and fix them. Okay, so I can close the builder. I can give my test landing page landing page i can save it and close it and now i can have a look at the preview url so as you can see i get my landing page here i can put my first name so today my name is uh let's say like um, elmer and family name is food and email is uh, that um, Dot fr and if i submit so this is my landing page on which i will communicate well um as you can see within matic oops within matic close the builder i will get in fact my uh, contact information which will be sent and which will automatically create uh, one uh, contact in matic and that's everything that i wanted to show you so just to let you know that before starting the landing page, you will need to design the form and expect what are the value that you would like to get. And the landing page is really the part where you design, in fact, the page on which people will land on and you can change everything that you want. And you can, of course, start from a full blank page 
and every time that data are sent through those forms they are automatically filling the uh, CRM of Motic. I hope that it helps. Thanks for watching.